guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I'll be reacting really to episodes 4 and 5 of Banner of the Stars 2. So let's go ahead and get started with episode 4 and 3, 2, 1, go. Now this has to be like the first of many shifts that are going to come and get all these people, right? I mean, they could have at least given these people, like, places to sit. Technically, in a way, they have. But, like, okay, you know how, like, on an airplane or, like, on one of the big military um, type of planes where they have, like, a certain thing on the side, like, railings and stuff where people can sit on? They could have had that for them. They have no seat belts. I'm just saying. Fifteen thousand people, and there's still so much more, right? Oh! <laughs> One, I cannot believe we only have. Hold on, so we're on four and five, six, seven, eight, nine. I have three more weeks, but technically, really, two more weeks with this show. And I can't believe I'm. I'm we're really done, and especially because of the fact is like. I know there's more to this show, and I'm guessing, like, the next thing that is after this is a prequel, but because the person who requested this only had me go from Crest all the way to Banner 2, um, of course this is gonna be the end. Duh. But at the same time, like, I, me, myself, I'm curious, and something's gonna tell me that probably when I finish this in, like, two weeks, um... I might, like, end up watching the others. Because, mm, God, because, see, you know, this weekend is the new year, so. I could, mm. Could I watch everything? Maybe. Can I? I don't know. I mean, I know I'm going to clean this weekend, but that, and then I don't know if anything else for, like, all the other shows that I'm watching start this week. Because, <laughs> I need to. I need to check at least before I go to bed tonight so I can be like, okay, you start this day, you start that day. Please, God, don't have anything come on Sunday. Don't have anything come out Saturday. Pretty Cure ain't coming out until next week, so oof. I'm okay with that, though. My bag is, like, all the way over there. That's one of the things I want right now. Yeah, that's very strange. It's a possibility. And then what are you doing? Relaxing?
Well, you know, maybe they just don't have no loot. I can't speak. <laughs> they have no use to destroy you today. <laughs> Well, but of course he's going to show concern to you anyway. <laughs> god, like once again, break her like a merry freaking couple. Oh my god. Yeah, I think he's sure. I mean, there's really no reason. If he says no, then no. Don't go for it. Oh, hey, Cody.
Yeah, let me guess, because you are bored and you are typically always known to destroy things. You're going to go after them, correct? See, the keyword is probably, which 50 out of 50, there might be. I don't really think so. <laughs> exactly. And who likes being bored? Might as well. Come on. Of course. What are we so surprised about that? She likes the thrill of fighting. Come on now. We, we, you know, we, we women, we catty bitches, you know, sometimes we want to fight. So then what else would you do? True. So should you just not go through with this? You sure about that, though? Basically, yeah, more or less.
Of course, you don't want anything happening to you guys or that ship, so I get it. Wouldn't it just be better for, you know, Lafayette and everybody else to just come to Jinto and just stay there until it's safe? Yeah, but hold on. How long could that be? You will. It's just going to take some time. Not everybody was going to get off like day freaking one. Jesus. Look at that. Yes, for your safety. You want to go ahead and die? Be my freaking guest. Go out there, be on that ship, and boom, go ahead. Do you, you know? Deuces. But to be safe and for your safety, just stay here. Yeah, because that's all he can give you as of right now. Jesus! You think it's gonna be two fucking months, Jinta? See, y'all say that, and then it's going to be even longer. This is the longest time, once again, that these two have been so freaking separated from each other. To not be able to see each other day after day, to spend time with each other. You're making my heart break. Every single episode of this final season just breaking my freaking heart. I don't like this. It fucking has. And I hate the fact that you accept y'all see each other and get it high. Like, ah! <laughs>
It's just getting worse. The longer these people are just staying down here. And it has to be that two month blah, 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 that two month mark. You would be drunk as of right now. As best as they could, though. See, Jinto, you say that? You freaking say that. Mm. Shit, they're kidding him. Of course, because who else would it be? I, I cannot. I cannot. Like, I, <laughs> this season. Oh, my God. You know what? However this show ends with this final season, I'm probably going to end up saying, because I'm going to go ahead and say it now, and then, you know, in the next two weeks, I'll probably end up saying the same thing. In my opinion, this show ended with Bear of the Stars 1. 1. Because... Like I said, my every single episode from episode one to now episode four going on to episode five, my heart is breaking for them. Both of them. I hate the fact that these two are not together. The fact that Jinto is on Earth and Lafayette, you know, still in space doing her own thing, trying to protect and deal with her, her own situations and everything. <sighs> I can't. This is too much. This is too much. Like, stop my heart. See, something tells me I'm gonna I'm gonna do the stupidest thing this weekend. Even though I gotta clean and I probably got some other things to react to, I'm probably gonna finish watching this show this weekend just so that I can finish it, so that I don't have to disappoint myself in two weeks from now. Let's disappoint myself this weekend, seriously, because. I need to know how this is going to end. We Well, technically, we already know how this is going to end. That first fucking episode basically gave us the answer right then and there. And of course, when we get to episode 10, we're going to rewind back to that moment in episode 1. And I'm just going to cry. Oh, this is just too much. Like, why couldn't Kikin Love be down here? I have nothing else to say. I really don't. I got nothing. Nothing. Nothing to say about this. Uh, this is frustrating because, you know, you have three different people, technically four, all these different prime ministers of these certain, quote unquote, once again, districts, not still seeing eye to eye, even when Jinto comes down and he becomes a leader and takes this leadership role and being a higher up person for these people, they still can't see it eye to eye. We are now reaching still somewhat of a conclusion for this show where, once again, we do know how this is going to end. Um, but who knows? It could change. Who knows? Maybe. But the fact is, like, most of these men were like, leave the women, come back for us. All of y'all are fucking important. All of y'all are important. And I just wish, I understand why, you know, yes, Lafayette was like, no, it's better if we stay, you know, let them wait. But two months is a little too late and a little too much time because yes people are going to get irritated this is that and third and they're all going to try to find their own different source of way of getting the fuck out of off this planet 
but I, I can't. <laughs> this is too much. But go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode five. Okay, episode five in three, two, one, go. Yeah, but still at the same time, we could have just said, screw the criminals and just left them. But it's like, no, they're people too. Mm. They're just destroying everything. They're just making it worse for the situation that's going to come in like the next few months. Mm. And they don't care. Okay, let's just wave up the white flag, please. And of course. Yeah, I'm definitely finishing this this week. I'm, mm -hmm. Cause I feel like I, I need to know. I really do, and I, I think I won't be able to do this tomorrow because, of course, New Year. And I think the only days that I can kind of record seven, no, not seven, six to episode ten is really. Saturday, Sunday, and Monday with the fact that I'm going to be cleaning my room, the whole house, everything else, <laughs> and such. And then also with the fact is I need to check to see when the heck the shows that I'm watching are coming the fuck out because I don't fucking know. Well, one of them should be possibly out as of right now but that's just an hour-long special and of course i don't really count that because it's just one and done if it was episodic then yes but because it is just an hour-long special it's there it's done like uh Yeah, she might not know anything.
unfortunately. She needs to hear this. Of course, there's got to be others no matter what. And how are they supposed to do that? <laughs> you don't have to push him like that. Jesus. anymore. Mm-hmm. Unfortunately. You just go. There's really nothing else that they can do. And you have no time, so...
hell, y'all not hurrying up for me. There's a bomb on that ship. Like, what, though? Ah. Uh. We got ten minutes left. <laughs> Anything can happen in ten minutes. You're right. Just be careful, please. Once again, they're not hurrying for me. Like, I need y'all to go, like... <sighs> like, you, you are on your way... Uh, you on vacation and you ready to go somewhere else, basically. <laughs>
Okay, then just freaking retreat. What else can you do? So you want to say like 30 minutes? Yeah, so you don't want the He understands. Yeah, but still, that's reckless, though. <laughs> yeah, you know she's going to be upset about this anyway. Ah! 
We ain't got nobody Girl, go home with these two though. Okay, what? Two people. <laughs> we ain't got more. Because there's a traitor among y'all. Five. Five isn't enough. Now, how is he going to get off? He, how is he going to get out of the situation? You just, you, I thought you were going to be okay. Now you're not going to be able to talk to me like you're your girlfriend. Oh my. Oh, I can't. I'm fi- like I said, I'm finished in this this weekend. I am finishing this show this weekend. I no 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 because I cannot wait until next week to watch two episodes. I can't. So I'm like I said, I'm gonna be stupid and Saturday, Sunday, and Monday before I go to work again next week on Tuesday, I'm finishing this show so that I can see how it concludes. And of course y'all are getting the rest of this on um let's see. You guys will be getting the next two episodes of this so that would be this is four and five so two and three on the six so the 13 mm-hmm. all right yeah mm-hmm. on 13 so <laughs> I got a little time. We go, oh yeah, we definitely finish in this this weekend, especially with the way each of these episodes are ending so um abruptly and almost like cliffhangerly, even though I hate cliffhangers. want her to go down there and get him. Bring him home. I need him to come back so he can be with her and be a whole. I'm like, come on, be a little family. <laughs> Just give me that happy ending that I want. Ever since the end of Banner 1, like, you, you gave me hope. And then that first episode of Banner 2, you're like, hey, you know that hope? Let's turn it into despair. Like, y'all literally know. Okay, this show, once again, is a roller coaster of emotions, especially with this last season. This is like, okay, <laughs> this is like how I felt last season, or not even last season, last freaking year with Akudama Drive or anything that Kodaka has made. So, Akudama Drive, freaking Dangan Ropa 1, 2, V3, Ultra Despair Girls. Um,. Well, I can't say Tribe 9 yet because, you know, Tribe 9 hasn't come out yet. But, of course, when you have, like, w- the mind of Kadaka and you look at these characters and you're like, <laughs> you know, all these characters ain't going to make it by the end of this series. And you're playing the game and such and you're sitting here and you find out who dies and stuff every single time. And then you find out who killed who and it hurts. And you're like, oh, my God, I can't with this pain. And you think... By the final game of the freaking series, you're like, okay, you know, I see a lot of death, a lot of despair, nothing can hurt me now, and then you get very attached to a character, or characters, and then next thing you know that the character that you like a lot is the person who committed the crime, and then they die, and then you're over here crying over said character and such it, even though it's been so many it's been like how long has it been since v3 came out on playstation it's been like what two 
three, three, four, five years. And I'm still upset about that ish. And it's worse because of the fact is the person who played that character, um, one of my favorite characters, Kayere in V3, um, her seiyuu is no longer here. If if you've read, well, by the time y'all will see this, it's been probably maybe about two weeks after um, she passed away. Um it's still sad. It really is. Plus, she was Yuna in Sora Online, and she was freaking Anna from Frozen and such. But, like, oh, God, this is... It, it's just my heart. I can't take this anymore. I, I just... I need to know how the fuck this is gonna end. So, yeah, definitely this weekend, I need to just sit my butt down between everything else that I'm going to do. So, I need to make files of the last... Five? Yeah, five. Five episodes, like tomorrow or Saturday so I can get everything done. That's all. But I mean, they were still good. I hate the fact that we now, it, it's like a traitor within a traitor and such. But uh, I'm just scared to see how this is going to really conclude. Even though, like I said, we kind of know how it is, but still. Other than that, guys, that was my reaction view towards episodes four and five of Banner of the Stars 2. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Magical Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all um, next Saturday for Patreons. And then for the rest of you, like I said, I will see you guys on the 20th for episodes 6 and 7. But until then, I will see you guys all next time. Bye, guys.